almost there already. I mail. Mm -hmm. Almost there. Okay. Almost there. Got it. Oh, he gave me a notification. Yeah. Oh, no, ma. Uh, I may or Facebook, I may or can't talk. You touch your audience again. Since I have to see any streaming, how do I connect? Okay, it's already there. Okay. Hi, hi. I may or can't talk on Facebook. Hi, hi. I saw. Uh, okay, I saw. Yeah. Yes. Okay, we are online. Yeah, are we online? Yes, we are. Okay. Hi, hi. Good evening. Hi. There's only four participants. You, Master Lily, want to wait one, two minutes? Let yeah, uh, wait for a while. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so just there. Okay. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. I saw. Uh, okay. But uh, yeah, there's seven yeah. people already. Yeah, I'm not familiar. Okay. Yeah, online. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, Hello. Uh, okay. Hi. Hi. Good evening. Hi. There's only four participants. Let's wait for a while. Wait one two minutes. Hi, David. I see uh uh in the comments box. Uh, Master Lillian, your your student. David yeah. Hello. Ho. Hello, David Ho. Hi. Hello, David Lim. Yeah, Hello, Lina Sai. Hi. 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 Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. David, Good evening, Liner, David. I see David here. Good evening, Good everybody. Good evening, Moon. Hi, Moon Cock. Good evening. I see uh, uh, in the comment box, uh, Master Lillian, your yeah. Moon, say hi to us. I Hello. Hi, hi, Moon. Hi. hi. Thank you for joining. Hope you all have a great dinner. Uh, Yao Xian. Hello. Ashton, hello. Ashton, Ashton hello. Hello, hello. Xian Chan, hello. Dajia, wan shang hao. Wan shang hao. Good evening, hello. Master Lillian. Chi bao le ma? Joining. Hope you all have a great dinner. Yao Xian, hello. Ashton, hello. Ashton, hello. Hello, hello. Xian Chan, hello. 老师，我听到一些feedback从你那边来。OK，我这边哦是看不到。Hello okay. James V. Hello, I saw James. Hello James V. Uncle James. Hello, hello. So um because I not very familiar with the uh uh Facebook live. Facebook live. So yeah. if in case I see I didn't I did see your messages. Uh, Mandy, I will need your help. To, yes, no problem. Show Pleasure. me. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much. So and we're gonna start in a while. Thank you for joining. Yes. Uh, it's gonna start for you in a while. Yeah, I see you have 20 people on the live. Thank you. And so without further ado, so um we're good start. evening. Yes, we're gonna start. Uh so it is just like a evening casual chit chat session right, with right. Lillian. So and thank you so much for your time and thank you so much for organizing these uh, live sessions and thank let you, all of us know about yes thank you thank you so much for your precious time to let everyone know all about um, romance and relationship luck in Zueto Su. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Mandy. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for joining. We're going to start the sessions very soon. So um yeah, thank you very much. Okay, um Mandy. Um, it's very good to have you in my chat right now in this Facebook Live. So, you know, our goal of life is to achieve happiness, right? So, yeah. maybe you can tell me more. What have you gained through this um, understanding of Zui Dong Su? Yes, uh, Master Lillian, I also, also find that a lot of people go of life is to achieve happiness. But some people are finding it difficult to achieve this one, especially so many changes are taking place these times. So um, what I learned from Zui Dou Su is that uh, it's actually a, a Chinese metaphysic technique to read one destiny. So I understand they are they they are actually twelve palaces in Zui Dou Su. So uh, right. in my humble memory, so I remember Ming Xiong Fu Zi Cai Ji Qian You Guan Zai Fu Fu. So and mm -hmm. also yeah, and I remember your teaching that it's also fourteen main star and four auxiliary star in this uh being adopted in this technique yes yes you see as soon as we are born and people some of you here may not know what is now as soon as we are born our fate and destiny begins 
right? So Zwei Dou Su is the system that we use to use for forecasting our personal luck. It's very much on our personal luck reading, right? But when you dwell deeper, Zwei Dou Su is not just forecasting on the personal luck. It go deeper about a, a personal life, a life, a life of a person. It's more like a philosophy of life, okay? It, it lets you understand about yourself, how you carry your life, you know, and let create this awareness for you. It's also because of through this awareness, we begin to get our clarity. When we have this clarity, we can move on. You know, we call, you know, through this, this path, we have an understanding of where we're heading to. So Zwei Dou Su has this kind of capability to help a person understand their philosophy of life. And uh, very much people use this for decoding the events reading. Now, you mentioned that you understand the way Dou Su has got these 12 palaces. Now, let's take a look. What are these 12 palaces? These are the 12 palaces that everyone would have. As soon as you're born, it is plot based on your date of birth, time, include, um, or, and your year. Now, without the birth hour, you can plot the chart. So, the encompass 12 palaces, and what are they? Just now you mentioned Ming Xiong Qi Zi Tai Ji Qian Yong Zi Tian Fu Fu. Now in English it means self palace represents your character. Sibling palace represents your relationship with your siblings, the people your siblings your Xiong Di Jie Mei. Now spouse palace represents Fu Qi Gong, which is your attraction palace. This is, here we're talking about today the topic on romance luck, right? Here sharing the companion is about about for example. Um, people are looking for the ideal partner, but in reality, there's no people who are ideal. Okay, you have to be the person who's ideal for somebody else. Now, it also talks about Zini Gong. Zini Gong means your attraction palace to your children affinity. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, very interesting right now, we're going to share here is the Tai Bo Gong. Now, Tai Bo Gong, a lot of people say, a lot of people are targeting at these palaces. Now, let me tell you this. Tai Bo Gong is not a palace that is talking about you going to be very wealthy. You know, it's more of a palace that you generate your income. Today, you learn something and you spend your money. So it's more like your capacity to earn. Okay, because you earn, you can be successful, you can be rich, of course. And at the same time, how you spend your attitude of wealth management in this palace here. Right. So what about health palace? Mandy, what do you think? What is health palace that we have been talking about? You know, health palace. Why, what is health palace? So in nature, I remember your teaching health palace is just talking about uh, your, your health. But in a deeper layer, um, there is more meaning in your teachings. And also, I remember you also mentioned the 14 main star is also represents some meaning uh, with the um, some association with the palaces and there are some right. meaning when they yeah so maybe Master Lillian can you also tell us more a little bit more about the 14 stars so let, the, sure. let our friends know sure. I prefer I'll say hi to Lillian Chin say hi to Moon Kong hello thank hello. you for your support hi, hi. on the line yes and yeah, yeah. okay thank I really you run through the health palace and travel palace travel palace means Chen Yi Gong how you how you carry yourself outside Friends Palace is the relationship palace, right? Relationship with people, relationship with your customers, relationship with your good friends. These are the Friends Palace. Right. Career Palace, of course, we're talking about your career performance, your yes. workplace, your working luck, property, of course, your feng shui, your house you stay, your accumulated wealth. And the mental is your spiritual thinking, your mm -hmm. inner self-being. And parents, of course, is the relationship with your senior and your parents. Mm -hmm. Now, you talk about the 14 star. Yes, I'm going to bring up this 14 star for you. In Zui Dosu, there are 14 star. Right. So you right. first must understand this one. Now, this will not be all the, not everyone will have the same placement. So 14 star, there will be total 14 star. You go and count, there will be 14 star. And there will be four auxiliary star. Right. Yes. These four auxiliary star, we're not going to talk today. But however, I'm going to share what are the star that is very strong for relationship. You know, I can't cover all the 14 star because of the time that we have and our topic today was going to target only and romance and relationship. So now, Mandy, can you just remember, or right now, can you remember which other star that is very prospering for Tao Hua? Well, I remember Tang Lang is one of them. Uh, it's a very big, uh, one Tang of Lang the major here. star. Yeah. Yes, Tang Lang star. And the second, the second one is the Lian Zhen star. Okay. So, yes. Yeah. They are one. Okay, there are more than that, you know. There are this Zi Wei, Tian Xiang, Tai Yang, Tai Ying, Tang Lang, and Lian Zhen. You're right for two. The rest also are 
Okay, being why I said that, of course, these are the prospering star that governs relationship, but what you have mentioned correctly is Tang Lang and Lian Zhen, they are Tao Da Tao Hua. Supposedly, this Tang Lang Sing is actually residing in the spouse palace, right? This spouse palace become very prospering for relationship, right? So why do I say the rest are? Because let's talk about this star that is Zi Wei and Tian Fu. I also forget about Tian Fu. Tian Fu is also. Now, these two stars are leader stars. They are the king and the queen. queen. Now, you can find out from your own, um, you know, nowadays there's a lot of software available. You can just go and plot in your birth hours and your birth time, your birth month, you can find out. Now, if this star, this star is a leader, they are very strong leadership, but why is it that they are also part of the relationship star? Because why? These stars enjoy food. Okay, when they enjoy food, they enjoy good food, fine dining, they like to connect with people. So therefore, this star is also part of the relationship star. And the way being the emperor, of course, they have a people, they have to build relationship. And so as the queen, right? But because this star is the leader, they somehow, they are so strong, they exude a certain extent of charisma. So this, if you take a look at your spouse palace, if your spouse palace has the way and food, you are also attracting relationship, yes. right? Now, the other one, which is the Tai Yang and the Tai Ying, Right, Tai Yang represents the sun, okay, Tai Yang, and the Tai Ying represents the moon, right? right. Which is the, the 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 lady. One is a male and one is a female. It's also Obviously, like a yin and yang. Yeah, because of the yin and yang, there is a there are very high chance increases the chance of romance, love, and yeah. relationship. And you look at Tai Yang, isn't he good looking? He is very charismatic. So being a Tai Yang person, you know, uh, generally has this kind of attractions. All right. All right. So have especially if this now if you are a spouse, if you are a male and you have a high yang star in the spouse, male star, male chart having a male star in the spouse palace means you're attracting somebody very strong and very strong and ambitious lady. All right. On the other hand, if you are a female chart and then you have a tai in appearing in your spouse palace. It explains what it explains. You are meeting somebody who are meticulous and sentimental. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that explains. So of course we're talking about if a male chart having the woman chart here, then you know that's no problem. That's confirmed. That is, you're going to meet somebody very nice, very noble. You know, uh, you know, take care of your house matter. Now, if you are having a male, um, female chart and have a Tai Yang, okay, somebody you are meeting somebody very strong and capable. Okay, and uh, very career minded. So right. that explains Tai Yang and Tai Ying. Right. So, yeah, right. So then we're going to move on, say a few more before I go to detail. Say, for example, yeah. Tang Lang star. Now, this is the one of the most prospering star for Tang Lang. Mm -hmm. Now, <clears throat> if your Tang Lang, take a look, if your spouse palace appear on Tang Lang, generally, but generally, this person starts a relationship very early. Okay. And he's attracting to somebody, he or she is attracting to somebody talent, very talented as well. Okay, I'm not saying the rest are not, but generally this star likes to expand. Mm -hmm. Generally, this star is creative and this star has a sign of like desire to change. Desire, you know, the desires, keyword desire coming for this Tang Lang star, explain why this star is not stable at a young age. Yep. Lake successor, can we say that? Yeah. Okay, so when we meet such people who have this Tang Lang star in the spouse palace, mm -hmm. right? Generally, we will tell them, it's good for you to maybe start your relationship late. But nowadays, young people start their relationship quite late. So that's not much of a worry now. <laughs> okay. You know, you know, you realize that you notice that most of them are starting quite late right now. Yeah. Okay, we're well, talking about starting late means they, they bloom, they have the relationship early, but they got married, they get them, they get got married later. Right. Okay. Ideally, it will be after after 30s. Right. You know? So it's just like what different. you mentioned earlier on that they are actually focusing on uh to, 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 to generate more wealth and then uh, before they actually settle down. So Correct. that's why yeah, they kind of change already. So um, Martha Lillian, I also understand that, uh, you know, um, you, you, do you, uh, can you briefly also elaborate more about spouse palace um, after yeah. the stars that yeah. related to relationship? Fu Qi Gong. Okay, let's talk about, let's throw a little bit here. Fu Qi Gong, if you see. Fu Qi Gong represents here Fu and Qi. So if you're looking for ideal partner, isn't it this is the attraction palace that you're attracting yourself? You are what you're attracting. Fu represents 
Fu and Qi. So there are in this house or these palaces, it have two person inside. All right. So yeah. any any extra, okay, of course, will rock this palace. Right. So yeah. that's representing this palace is talking about. So there are Fu Qi is when you're attracting, when your chart here shows prospering stars such as those stars I've mentioned, mm -hmm. like Tang Lang Lian Zhen, chances of you attracting relationship is very, very high. Now, a lot of people looking for ideal, you know, looking for somebody perfect. But because we must understand that in this reality, in reality, there is no one is perfect. We are human. Human make mistake. Because we make mistake, we are human, you know. So therefore, if you have to set an expectation on your partner, thinking is that he is the... Uh, he should be meeting your expectations. Sometimes you find that relationship can be quite challenging, especially when they have, you know, just started the relationship or just started their marriage. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about companion. Now, companion relationship is also part fall into these palaces as well, mm -hmm. right? So if you're talking about the complexity of the relationship, it, so long as it involves a person's emotion, yin and yang, right? It all covered into these palaces. So it's a lot of balancing, uh, what do you call that? Balancing of your expectation to keep the relationship, you know, lasting, a long lasting relationship. So this is what we call Fu Qi Gong. So from Fu Qi Gong, we can see what is this person attracting. Say, for example, if this person has this star here, what do you think? In Fu Qi Gong, if you have uh, this Tian Tong star, happiness is everything to him. Huh? But doesn't mean a happiness star means he will forever be happy. Because we are living in the yin and yang duality. As such, there's always this uh, emotional, you know, sometimes certain days you are feeling good, certain days you feel high le level of energy, certain days you don't. So what do you think, Mandy? When this star Tian Tong appears in spouse palace, mm -hmm. what do you think? Yeah, so generally in, 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 a, in a glance that if this Tian Tong um, appearing in a spouse a palace, so that, that person, the chart owner will tend to attract someone, I, might, I would say maybe happy mental stage or younger looking, like what yeah. you share in your teaching. Yes. Younger looking. The person can never be forever happy. Now, when we talk about a person can be have an everlasting happy is when this person mental is already, the palace that governs the mental palace is this person already have the awareness really. He or she will be able to balance through. He will be able to find that lasting happiness. Now, if it depends somebody to be happy, your relationship, your emotion will be always be like that. Okay. Yeah. You will always be on the very wavy um you know, your emotion will always be on, on fluctuation. We're talking about fluctuating. So that's the reason why if you are depending on somebody to make you happy, okay, you must be ready that your relations will go up and down. Your emotion will be attracted or will be affected by this. You know, certain days you are good, certain times you are good. So you yeah. must understand that. Now, some people say, I don't want relationship. Now, is it possible? Don't want relationship. We, we mean, we're not talking about, you know, Marriage, some people can choose not to. We're talking about some people say, I don't want a relationship. Is it possible? Uh, well, I think that it is it's possible. Why not? And because in, in the modern world, this, this is uh, oftenly happened already. And uh, without we know, and this is already, you know, uh, some people will choose that not to settle down and not to find. Okay, that's, that's about marriage. La. Possible. But yeah. in, 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 in today's world, we are actually, relationship is important. Not as in marriage. Right, relationship and marriage. Of course, we're talking about marriage. There must be a relationship before and under. But here we are talking about relationships. So talk about friends like me and you. Your relationship with you, these people and people connection. Okay, yeah. relationship now comes into people involving people. Okay, there must be conversation. Same thing goes for Fu Qi. Okay, there must be a relationship that can be long lasting because there is a communication. Right. When party one party keep talking and the other party don't, literally this relationship somehow will actually be unstable. Yeah, more challenging. They have to go through more challenging, challenging, right? Yeah. So that's what I'm trying to say. Same thing back back to um, spouse palace. When we yeah. talk about spouse, there must be a communication, you yeah. know. But there is no communication somewhere. This relationship would not, you know, would somewhere long. We talk about very challenging. You will find that their relationship were unstrained over the years of time, yeah. and then they then they will start to have this doubt about whether this is the right person for them or for her or for him. So yeah. this is a quite a common uh uh problems 
that in Ziwei also people come for us and come for me to look into this relationship. Now, Fu Qi Gong is like that. Fu Qi is yuan fen, all right? San yuan, er yuan. Right. Wu yuan bu qi, dou si yuan. You know, everything is about yuan fen. You and me, today we meet, it's a form of destiny. Yes. Okay, this moment, we don't know. It may be a few years, it may be this moment, maybe one week, maybe we don't know. But as long as what has taught me in Ziwei Dou Su has taught me to cherish every people that comes to my life, that cross my path. Yes. When yeah. the time is right, everything ripens, and then things right. will meet. Now, Master Lilian, I often heard about uh, people talk about Gui Ren, Xiao Ren in relationship. How mm. do you, uh, can you briefly share with us more about like Gui Ren, Xiao Ren, not only in relationship palace, because maybe other, other audience, they are concerned about other palaces. How do you okay. see Gui Ren and Xiao Ren? Sure. Gui Ren and Xiao Ren, we can focus on few palaces, right? Now, Gui Ren and Xiao Ren, you see the Gui Ren, I put it so big, and the Xiao Ren, I put it smaller in the word, right? Now, Gui Ren and Xiao Ren, in Zi Wei Dou Su perspective, huh? okay, we look into a person's travel palace, friend's palace, and mental palace. These are the few palaces that we will pay attention. Why? Travel palace is when we go out, we will meet these people, right? Mental palace is your karma. Mental palace is your, we call your accumulated uh, 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 palaces of your merits that you attract people, whether you're attracting Quirin or you're attracting the, the, the negative people in your life, right? Yes. So the other part is the, we talk about the friends palace, okay, you're connecting with friends. So that's how we, we, we will bring in Quirin. Now, we, in order for you to, so from your understanding, Mandy, what is Quirin? Uh, Some of the yes. Quirin. As you say, it's nobleman and also people who lift you up and sometimes I will think that Gui Ren is also maybe a transformation from Xiao Ren because they give you the challenges and you pull through from the challenges and they become your Gui Ren. How, how do you see this thing? Yes, 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 correct. Okay, there are two. Okay, Gui Ren is young energy, right? Gui Ren is young energy and then Xiao Ren, of course, is yin energy, right? We must yes. understand this part here. Uh, when we... In order for us to reduce the chances of meeting this Xiao Ren, we first must pump up ourselves by meeting Gui Ren, right? From your chart, when you can see a star of Ke, which is like a helpful star inside that you're going to show in a while, okay, you can, if you can see some helpful, helpful combination or helpful transformation, you will see in your chart there will be Gui Ren, okay? Right. But you want to increase your Gui Ren or, and reduce the Xiao Ren, first of all, there are a few methods you can learn. All right, simple method that you don't need to learn Ziwei Dou Su. As such, you first of all, every morning, so first of all, you want to meet Gui Ren in your life, first of all, you must be learn how to be grateful. Okay, grateful right. to the people who come to you, whether grateful to people who have give you bad time, right. grateful to people who have um, give, you a, give you a hand, like this, right. this picture that I show you, grateful for people have teach us, grateful for our mentor, our parents, uh, our loved ones, First of all, you want to keep rising your high frequency of receiving Gui Ren. You must first of all, every moment, be grateful. Okay? Right. You and me will not be today who we are without, you know, we call Gui Ren is giving us the backup and support. Right? Yes. So your Xiao Ren in the tanks, you say, sometimes you think that they are Xiao Ren, but they're actually here to teach us something. Yes. Okay? Without that pain, we, will want to, we don't want to change. Correct or wrong? Yes. So I always appreciate when this person comes to life and giving me some kind of, say, for example, not very favorable, not very comfortable, but in, a play, in the first place, when I understand about life, I will go in and say, what has she or she taught me? Yes. Today, this person, what has she and she taught me? Okay. Yes. When this person is impatient, he taught me to be patient. Yes. When this person has a lot of anger, he taught me not to be angry. Yes. Okay. He taught me. When this person's, uh, 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 what do you call that? like to uh, bad mouth for somebody, I always prefer to say something good. Okay, right. so every moment I send this message, I put it by myself. So it's pumping up your Gui Ren. Yes. Okay. Second method is very easy. Surround yourself with the people who have a higher frequency than you. Mm -hmm. Okay, people with or equal frequency is also good or higher, right? The best you surround yourself with a higher frequency, you actually attract, you draw, yeah? Yes. 
So more positive people. But be yeah. aware uh, now because of COVID, right? Stay away from the positive, tested positive people, okay? You want to stay with the tested negative people. Yeah, but what Master Lillian is right, that stay with uh, positive uh, thinking people, which is the uh, highest frequency people. Yeah. What, what is higher frequency people? People who are, you know, we're, we're talking about generally people who are kind, more compassionate people, right? Who are willing to give, willing to share, willing to talk, willing also at least smile, you know, and always share something with a better objective, you know, than we, you know, than, you know, living the life on lament. So these are the people. And also learn one thing. Learn to say no if you don't like. Yes. Okay? Learn to say no. Okay, don't feel obligated. Learn to say no because you decide yourself. Okay, so next time you have no blame. You decide, you take your own responsibility. Learn to say no, no. You know, learn to stay away or move away politely when this environment is not conducive for your energy. Yeah. Right. Right. So, Master Lilian, I also uh, just now you also briefly mentioned about Ke. So, in this technique, flying technique, yeah. we understand that in Zui Do Su, in this flying technique, yeah. we actually right. uh, using this four transformation, right. which is we call Lu Quan Ke Ji. Right. So, can you tell us more about this Lu Quan Ke Ji? Maybe for some uh, audience, they were very keen to know about this. Okay, Lu Quan Ke Ji, some of them may not know. Some of you inside, I'm sure in the Facebook right now, there are some of my students here and also there are teachers. Okay, there are masters in this chat here. Now, in Zui Dou Su, the star also, be, just like us, when we born, you know, we, we you know, the, the, when we are born, we are, you know, when we born, when we are child, we will follow whatever is given. But as times grow, our behavior will change due to the external, external influences. Now, Zui Dou Su itself, okay, have this four transformation. That means you are brought in with four keys. As soon as you are born, Okay, what are the four keys? These four keys tells you you will give because you've done something good in your past. We believe in past life, right? You have done something good in your past, you will give you this loo. Okay, loo. Now you have done something that you are also very good in the past, they will give you some power. Yeah, it's like a saving, you deposit. And then yeah. you have the saving and then you can withdraw and, and enjoy the, the, the money. Correct. Everyone will have this four keys. Okay. Right. Okay. Because you've done something very good, they give you loot. Okay. They also give you something to go and work for it, fight for it. Say, for example, you go and chitzen chi. Okay. But when you need help, Santian Hui Pang Ni help her. Right. Okay. But because you have felt something here, that's why we're human here, we're back, back on earth. Okay. Right. You have something that you have to give back. That's why it makes you worry. Right. Okay. That's why we're living, if you understand that we're living in the duality, yin and yang concept, okay, you will have no, you will more or less know what I'm trying to say. You right. observe yourself, you will sometimes feel good, sometimes you feel no good, this is yin and yang. Right. Relationship also the same, yin and yang. So therefore, this Lu Quan Ke is a transformation in your palace that trigger the stars, just not the 14 stars. Yes. Even one of the stars. You won't know where until, you know, when you open up your chart, you know. Some yeah. of you are very lucky. They have this Lu happens to be in the wealth palace. Yeah. You know, that wealth palace like you. Understand? Yeah. Maybe you keep yeah. growing. Okay. Yeah. Some people are also really fortunate. They have this loot in their property. They have accumulate wealth assets. So you can see that people who have uh, wealthy, okay, we will look into the person's property palace. Yes, yes. Because there are also some people who are also pretty lucky at the travel palace have this curl. Just now I said, Gui Ren. Yes. You yes. Okay. I'm sure now these are the transformation that actually press the button, okay, trigger the star change the star's behavior even more effective. Yeah, it's just like our four seasons, spring, summer, winter, and autumn. Autumn and winter, chun xia chiu dong. So it means chun xia chiu dong. Chun xia chiu dong. Yes, so Master Lilian, I saw a question from the chat that, uh, hi, Jeffy Lo, thanks for your support. So Jeffy Lo has this question to Master Lilian. Mm. Uh, mental palace, are you referred to virtual palace? Yes. Mental palace, some people interview, um, some, some of them will interpret as virtue. Okay, let's go back to this palace here. 
some people will there's this palace called Fu De Gong. Fu De is your and your Okay, it represents your virtue, how you carry your life from the past, and how you become this part here. But this palace is where we can improve a lot, right? Now, destiny make up into two parts. One is the Ming, one is the Yun. Ming is Su Ming, that means where you are born here. Yun allow us to change. Therefore, through Zi Wei Dou Su, it allows you to understand, identify what luck you are going through, you can change. It right. also means by virtue. Yeah, correct. Virtue okay. palace. Yes. Yeah. Does it answer your question, Jeffrey? Now, I also coming. Uh, I also saw Jeffrey Low uh, coming for the second question. So he just yeah, sure, sure. put that Lu is a well and Ke is an education. I don't know what it. Okay. So he actually replies says that virtue palace is also known as body palace. But the this question he he actually mentioned about Lu is a well and Ke is an education. Uh, maybe you can, maybe Jeffrey, you can tell us more about it, or maybe let Master Lily. Okay, when I mean, maybe his interpretation basically clear is like aha moment, lah, you know, learn something. So if, if he's referring to education, means he learned something. This is the aha moment. Okay, that moment he picked up, he learned something. That's called aha moment. Now, if your curl appear to be yourself, so, sometimes you sit there, you have, you, you know, you can resolve. You have a problem at the moment, you just, you know, you give you the answer. That's the aha yeah. moment. It's yeah. the help. It's a guiren, but the guiren may not appear as a human. It can appear as one form of positive energy in your life. Right? Yeah. Yes. So maybe um Jeffrey, if I'm uh correct me if I'm wrong, uh maybe you can put in the comments box. So um Master Lin is trying to say the Lu Quan Ke Ji, uh it may not happen in wealth. She just stick it Lu in wealth is just an example. Because yeah. uh as we mentioned earlier on, there's child palaces, right? So it could be any of the palace, they will happen in this four transformation. Precisely. We don't know. So we need to actually zoom in into deeper layer and then to see. Of course, today is just a, it's just an introduction of this. So now, uh, Master Lin, I understand that, okay, talk about this Lu Quan Ke Ji, right? I understand that Zi Wei Dou Su, it can be a life transformation to oneself if they apply correctly with a correct mindset. It's about, Zi Wei Dou Su is about destiny, which we call Ming, and luck, we call Yun. So I right. uh, always see that people will you say, you know, zi yun zang yun. So how do you how do you perceive this this part like ming yun? Uh, like uh you you understand your destiny and you control your destiny, you can take control oh. of your destiny. Very good. Okay. Um ming yun. Right? You must understand ming yun. Uh, there are two parts. Ming represents the early heaven. Xian Tian da. Okay. Yun which is representing the whole Tian, the later heaven. We cannot change the early heaven, but through our Yun Qi, that means the Yun, uh, we can take control. You and me, we can't change. Just example, I cannot change, say I, I don't want the certain things, are, uh, certain events. Like our are parents, our siblings, these are all destined, we can't change. Yeah. Because but you can choose your spouse. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> maybe when, well, okay. Change your spouse when, you well, know. Married already them. cannot change us. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, right. So we call Ming Yun. You must understand Ming and Yun. It's two different. Ming is Xian Tian Dai. Okay, as soon as you're born, you have the Ming, right? Usually from 2 to 11, say for example, when a person is born as like, you know, 1 to 10 years old, you know, this part is more or less fated. All right. And then the 12 to 21, or maybe 12 to, or maybe 13 to, for example, 22, for example, these are the yun that people want to change but cannot change. Sometimes the parents will make decisions. So sometimes you think that the children are uh, 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 not obedient or rebellious. Actually, the truth is that because they actually begin to have their own intention and own thoughts, right? What begins, what you can take control, which is the whole Tian one, which is the later heaven day, which is the 22 to 31 onwards. That's where you are out from. You are already finish your education and you start working. Uh, so, is talk about Xian Tian Dai Lai de Gen Ho Tian Qi Yun de. Correct. So, we are talking about Zi Yun, Yun. Okay. It's telling you, you must know your luck, then you can change your luck. Yes. It's called Zi Yun, Zhang Yun. You first need to know your luck. You know your luck, you need to know your luck. You need to know your luck, you need to know your luck, you need to know your luck. But without the luck, there is no luck. So they are interconnected. Without the Ming, there will be no Yun. Right? You cannot yeah. just, it, it will never be a standalone. The, 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 the Ming Yun and Ming Yun is all together. 
right? Yeah, inseparable. So understand yun is a movement of qi. Yun qi ma? Yun qi is a movement of qi. Now, if the qi is moving and you're not moving, won't you feel stuck? Yes. When the qi is changing and you're not changing, of course you feel stuck, right? Yes. So the way Tosu governs the qi movements, telling you it's time to move, but if you are still holding back, you're going against the current, of course, you use a lot of your energy to go against car. Of course, you feel frustrated. Of course, you yeah. feel stuck because yeah. you don't want to change. Yeah. Okay. People, people often resist the change. It's like they, they prefer to stay in their comfort zone. But I always feel that change is actually beautiful. It's only resistant to change is painful. Yeah. Resistant to change is painful. Why people don't want to change? Because people are afraid. Because cannot see. There's no clarity. They do not know these changes is good or not. Therefore, this is where we are here. Now, yeah. whatever changes that take place that involve three things, you know, maybe, you know, um, for every event, for everything that's coming forward to a change, there must be some kind of element that take place. What is that? So I wanted to ask you this about uh, this question. So, so you always, we always heard about people say, 天地人. So um, is, is, are, you, are you trying to connect a uh, link to this part? Because I always yeah. often heard people say about Tian Di Ren. So can you also briefly explain more about, um, I don't know how to translate this in English. It's called Tian Cui Xiang, Di Chen Xing, Ren Chen Shi. Okay, Tian Cui Xiang. Tian is an indication, okay, where the heavenly timing align with the star in the place. Di Chen Xing. The environment that we are in already configured for us that can influence our luck. Learn right. the discipline and action that we are thinking and we are doing that give us the outcome. Now, for every event to take place, there must be a presence of these three things. Say, for example, today, you know, I was just talking to you, Mandy. You know, I have the intention. Um, to want to have somebody with me to join this conversation. Tian, the heavenly timing already aligned probably in my chart. And I'm looking for somebody who is the right person for me to at this timing, T. Okay. With this con environment, conducive environment, T. Okay. To make this thing happen. But in order for me to make this thing happen, I have to call you, I have to talk to you. And then I have to send the invites. I have to send the, you know, and then I have to make the announcement. With Tian Di Ren, today I make up this event. So when people come in, you know, uh, whether um, there are a lot or doesn't matter, or not many people, doesn't matter. I have fulfilled this Tian Di Ren. So for any things that happen, even for a relationship that we're talking about, you want to get to know this person, the star must align timely in your chart. Yeah. Okay. Then the environment happens, you go out to this place, maybe you go to Tanjong Baga, for example, and then it connects this place with these people align that place. And then you say, hi, let's have a drink, for example. Now, these three things, come, then this person starts to connect and they start to build relationship. So three, every three, the three for an event to take place, three events to place. Say, for example, if this person wants a relationship, okay, but you can see that there's no formation of Maybe one of the elements is missing. Okay. So therefore, sometimes we must also have um explain clearly that the certain time that you have answered, 天有地没有人, or maybe you tian I say you got a relationship, but she's doing nothing. I say you got this opportunity, but he or she not doing anything. Okay. But if this person you tian, but the timing, the environment doesn't support what he's doing. It also cannot success, be successful. Yeah. So you can understand means three things must take place. Yeah. Yes. Yes. All right. So this yes. is how we explain uh, you know. So yeah. So I don't know whether I explain so much. Maybe people want to find out about how to look into their relationship. Now, relationship, yeah. always remember, is the most important in our today's world. Now, yeah. without relationship, there's a lot of things we cannot do. Yeah. Okay, We have to build, we have to, there's a lot of interaction. You know, we have, must understand how to improve relationship. At yeah. least we must know how to, if you really want to um, follow this fast-changing world, you must mm -hmm. first of all know how to connect people. 
Yes, it's just like what uh, Chiu Ling in the chat, she actually mentioned 天地人和, a very, very good uh, uh, slogan for us to see. 对,天地人和, okay? 有天有地没有人不行, 有天有人没有地也不行, 有人, 有地有人没有天也不行, 对, yeah. So that's the reason why, that, what does that give me the thoughts? That does it give me the lot insight. For me to meet you, there's a candy run. For me to meet my teachers, there are candy run. For me to meet my 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 husband, there are candy run. For me to have my children, there must be a candy run. Yuanfen, that's the name. Yuanfen. All yeah. this make up to a uh, yuanfen. You know, there's no if there's your yuan you know, you still cannot meet this person or not destined to meet this person. Uh, maybe for short term. Yeah. yeah. So that's how we understand the way also what this the way also has give us a lot of our insight. What kind of people you will meet? Yes. Okay. Uh, what kind of people that will come to you? The stars will also denote what kind of a character in you. Mm -hmm. If the character that is fine, that is hard to handle for yourself, people find you hard to handle, people are distancing you, maybe you should look into yourself. Why is that people are not, why is that your reunion be jiao cha, for example? Why is it that you have less friends? Maybe you yes. should look into, into your own personal life. You know, mm -hmm. what should you improve on your yes. personality and character? Yeah. Yes. So Master Lilian, you also talk about 十二宫位找夫妻宫要找找 spouse, right? So what if if a person chart that is no star seat in the spouse palace, how do you perceive this? Very interesting. There are some chart you will see that all the star go one side and one, one palace, some palace don't have. I've always mentioned people say a lot of very common questions people ask, you know. 我的夫妻公是空公,那我还有老公, you know, last time we have a student also mentioned like that. So 空公不代表没有老公, you know, and then 空公隐私女公不代表没有子女. 空公 represents this palace is actually susceptible to external influences. That means you have to move. 往外找,需要往外发展. 家里没有人,所以要出去外面. It represents this palace. Palace itself has got no opinion. That means no You know, mm. because nothing, no strong star is holding in. So yeah. this palace becomes empty because this palace is empty. It's actually easily influenced by external um, problems, uh, external issues. So meaning to say, it, it has to. It also on the other side, I will look at it as actually unlimited possibilities. Right. You know, let's say your wealth is empty it doesn't mean that you have no money. You know, so a lot of people has misunderstood Hong Kong. Kong Kong representing unlimited opportunity, opportunity, unlimited possibilities. So I hope yeah. that, that let people think it more positively, you right. know. Yeah. yeah. So, Which is true. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. So Master Lilian, what, what do you think if uh besides Fu Chi Kong to, to find your partner or your spouse, um, do you think any possibility to look at other palace so that let our audience to to maybe know more yes. about this? Yeah. Where do you find first of all, where do you meet your when was the first, how do you meet your, your, your spouse or your wife? It must be uh, your husband or your wife. It could be social somewhere, palace. social network. So it comes from a friend palace. You to know, you know, social network. Another palace that I'm looking at is also travel. Yes. Okay. You go out, you know, you just stay at home, you go out. Okay. Yes. You stay at home and you see whether you can find your full chi or not, you can't. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You go out and then you bring her home or you bring him home. That becomes a Fu Chi Gong. Yeah. Chiu Ling also answered from the chat that it's a friend's palace. Yeah. Chiu Ling. Um, travel palace also. Thank you, Chiu Ling. Chiu Ling is a very, uh, she, she, she learns the way to suit. Now she also helped me support my answering yeah. the question. Thank you, Chiu Ling. Uh, okay. Yeah. Then there is this uh, travel palace. Now, if your star travel palace has a moon star, moon, Tai Ying. Just now people remember the moon, right? Yeah. If you have this star here, say for example, inside here, there's this moon here. Now, means to say you tend to attract female support luck. Mm. Or can we, we can say more affinity with female. Yes. Your Ni Ren Yuan, if it is Ni Ren Yuan, no. chart. Okay. Ah, okay, Ni Ren Yuan. So ah. it's, it's a charisma star also? Yeah. It's a Tao Hua right. star also. Okay. It's a Tao Hua star also. Right. It's one right. of the star that is Tao Hua. Right. Yeah. Yeah, so now if those people have questions that um, maybe Mandy you can help me because I can't see from my... Yes, i actually checking but actually there's no but I see one uh, comment uh, again from Jeffrey Lowe. He's talking about interconnect to triangular and four zhen. I, I think he's talking about... San Fang Si Zhen. Yes. Okay, San Fang Si Zhen. 
Um, that's the way to suit terminology. San Fang means, why is it called San Fang? Look at the green part. The green one, green. Uh. This green one means Cai Guan. That's your San Fang. Si Zheng, we talk about your travel opposite. Yeah. Okay. So because why they always like to um, use this terminology, San Fang, because Ming is very important. Without the Ming, you don't talk about other palaces, right? You must have a life. Yeah. Okay, then when when what is a survivor? Uh, this part here we call the wealth palace. Okay, this is the part where we have to generate our wealth. We need to make a living. Now, a lot of people say uh, money is not important. I have to tell you, money is important. Money is important because money be, is important for us to do what we want to do. Okay, but the right, the attitude towards money is very important. Your good attitude towards Money is very important because in order for us to do what we want, say for example, I want to have a dream house, I want to have a dream car, you have to work hard for it. Okay, so money, in other words, is an important survival for us to make a is for us to make a living. So money is very important. So therefore, Ming Chai Guan, with this money, where this money come from? Career. You have to work. We are given both hands. Okay, something give us also. Okay, we have to serve. So therefore, Ming Chai Guan plays a very important role for us in this, on this earth. So we, that's the reason why people say, Sun. then of course, you, in order for you to make your career a success, you need to travel. Okay, that's called San Fang Si Zhen. No? That's yes. what it means. Yeah. yeah. And I also see a comment coming again from Jeffrey. Thank you so much for uh, so interacting. Yes. yes, he is talking about Tai Ying is a well star and it also defies wisdom and beautiful. I think, is he a practitioner? He knows a lot, Tai Ying governs. Tai Ying governs. Alright, because Tai Ying manages the property. So property is an asset, therefore it's a wealth. Okay. Tai Yang is somebody who likes to give, likes to rise and Generous. shine. Yeah. So those who have a Tai Yang in the self is also supposed to give. Sorry? I think I'm not sure whether it's a network. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I, I'm just saying that Tai Yang is Tai Yang. I always think that Yin and Yang is very beautiful. It's just like Tai Yang and Tai Yin. They shine at their own time and they don't cross each other. Like Tai Yang is only, they only work in the daytime and Tai Yin, moon, they shine on the nighttime. Uh, they, they, yeah. they, they shine at there their own time. That. Yes. Correct. Correct. You see, the Tai Yang and Tai Yin represent Yin Yang. Right, for a relationship also represents yin yang. So gu yin bu zhang, du yang bu shen. That's why when a man a relationship, man and male, uh, a man and a woman relationship, they enter, they have this emotion balance. That's called yin and yang. All right. So that's and then we must always always understand that we're living in this yin yang. Mm -hmm. Okay. When when too much of a yang, okay, prepare things to come down, repent the darkness. When we are very successful, very successful. So always, that's also taught me to be. When we are successful, we got to be grateful. When we're successful, we got to be humble. Okay, but when um things are not going the way you want, tell yourself the yang is entering. Okay, the tai chi yang. Yeah. There will be light along the way. Just don't give up. So yeah. always, why people um why people um fall hard or why people you know halfway they give up is because they don't understand of this 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 yin yang concept mm -hmm. yeah so that's always remind me always when we are when we're doing well we always remember who are the people who has supported us who has lift us up this yeah. is something that i live with my day to day i always keep this in my mind every day Okay, yeah, I also we're... remember in your teaching you shared about uh people who is going on the peak of their life Okay, yeah. once it reaches the max, it will overturn. Right? Yeah. So when you know about this yin yang concept, that means yin yang, yin zhong you yang, yang zhong you yin, you will forever tell yourself, hey, you know, you know that you are almost a pig already. So time to go look, look in. Okay, time to do your uh, give. Time to it's about time for you to give away something. Okay, time to give and time to tell yourself who are the people that has been uh giving you all this support all these years, who are the people? My students, okay? My students has been supporting my work. My husband has been supporting my work. My partners has been supporting my work. 
my uh, uh, who else? There are so many people who are supporting my work. You know, 我身边好多好多很好的人, you know, I view also, 真的真的很感激. It's because of this, I keep thinking myself, then I should give more. So that's why I came up with this session. I like to share something which I think is worth sharing about relationship because relationship is so important. Without relationship, there's nothing we can do. Go out, you need a relationship. You go to the company, you need a relationship. You want to make an income, you need a relationship, right? Yeah. Everything is relationship. That's where Facebook become very successful. They connect people, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah, become very, very successful. Yeah. So, Master Lilian, go back to the previous question when I talk about change, right? So, a lot of people usually when, you know, um, when they start uh, they talk about change. How do you see the change, right? Some, some people will, will think that change is like how they take control and change the external luck or something like that. But we understand that change is actually from self, yourself. So how do you perceive in change? Okay. Change means uh, usually from the perspective, your chart will show the changes where it's going to take place because one of them, every, every year there will be a 10 year luck. Okay. So when these changes take place, the Si Nian Yun, we call the, the, the we call the ten year luck. Huh? Ten year luck, everyone will have a governor, ten year luck, next ten year luck, ten year luck, and ten year luck, things like that. This ten year luck will stir a person's emotion when it's coming to a new luck cycle. It will start to affect the person's emotion and decisions. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it in will, a layman term, we can sorry to interrupt. So in a layman term for, for all your audience, um, we can we can say it's the star that enter to the palace. Uh, stacking with the decade or maybe the luck cycle yeah, the that luck. it govern the thinking, it yeah. govern the interest All level. Right. Yeah, uh, okay. correct. So right. when we look into a person luck, because that's a higher level where students are learning, we look at the yun, we at the yun, yun. And then, just like I mentioned, yun is the yun. Yun So that's why we, we talk about change. I look at the yun. I don't look at the ming. Ming is the base. Ming is about your personality, your character, what you have brought here, what you have to pay, what you have to own, what you have to receive. But it's the yun, okay, that gives you the change. Now, if your yun does not support you to change that year, no matter how you want to change, also cannot change. Yes. So, Master Lilian, um, on the comments box, thank you, Lilian Chin. So, Lilian Chin asking a question that if one has a few suitor, can Zi Wei Dosu tell who is the Zeming Tianzi out of the few just by looking at our own chart. Thank you, yeah. Lillian. Interesting yeah. question. Lillian. Okay. Okay. Sure. So let's say, for example, 他什么是真命天子? Now, you look at the spouse palace. First of all, 谁都是他可以的真命天子? You remember I mentioned, you are what you're attracting. Okay. You are what you're attracting. People are looking for ideal, right? Ideal. Of course, we are looking into this compatibility in the way to so We look into, first of all, the Fuqi Gong. If this Fu Qi Gong is we call weak, right? Weak as in like uh, there are some negative energy inside. All right. Then there are three, two person came in. Okay, what's the maintenance of person like maybe two A and B, okay, and maybe A B C right? Mr. A, now now we're talking about if the Fu Qi Gong is weak already, yeah, weak, uh, okay. Means to say if you will meet somebody of the same age, Mr. A is the same age as the chart owner, this relationship may not match. Okay. Mr. B has a failed relationship before, okay, but of the same age. All right, that's one. Huh? Then there's Mr. C has a failed relationship, but a wider age gap. But by looking at the spouse palace, maybe it's very weak. This palace, Mr. C has a failed relationship, but at a wider age gap may match better. Of course, we have to look into that person's chart because say again, this palace is weak, means she is going to attract somebody who is a very weak relationship in the past. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's called your termin. So maybe some you know. But trying to say is we're trying to match uh the category of people that he comes to a life. So in a way, in the first place, he will meet somebody when the palace is weak, means he will have a problem with the relationship. Okay, so he has to meet with somebody we call answer that weakness of the relationship. So can I say right. <laughs> okay, but very good. Interestingly, Mandy, most of the time people will never have a chance to meet because it's fated. Okay. Yeah, they will they just will follow the, the destiny luck. Yeah. Because remember, mm -hmm. you got to repay. So Fu Chi Si Yuan. Some people will have a Sun Yuan. They meet somebody who really keep the relationship and romance always alive. 
，二元 means 每天吵架。Yeah， 你、okay. 来讨债。So that something we call the karmic debt lah. Yeah. You know, something you have to repay. So because of this karmic debt, you may not have a chance to get connected with the practitioner first. Hmm. Yeah. They actually answer. Then after they got a chance to guide you, nah, and then they come. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nothing much coming from nothing. Nothing much questions coming from the comment sure. box. Ah,、uh, but David Lim actually put a comment which I think is very good. He said, "In fact, relationship also dealt with destiny too. No matter whether it's personal friendship,、right. sibling, and relative." Correct. Exactly. You know, before we end the session, I want to tell everybody is that relationship. You look at these twelve palaces. Everything's about relationship. Okay. Our spouse palace, our siblings' in relationship. Our spouse palace, our children palace, our parents palace, our friend palace. All these are relationship. Now, sibling palace and friends is very important. It has taught me to build good relationship with my siblings. I have very good brothers and、uh, sisters as well.、Yeah. I've got good friends. It also taught me to build relationship with my children. I listen to my children. It also taught me. I learn from them because I think that there's a lot of things that they already know that I don't know, such as many technologies. They already very. They are very, it. They are much more, much more knowledge than me because of these changes that we have to、yeah. learn. They can、I、be your teacher、them. in some way. They are, of course. Okay,、yeah. so we will listen to the young. We let them grow.、Mm -hmm. We respect the old, you know. At the same time. So because why the older people are like my parents, my mom who supported me, you know,、uh, all this, these are all the relationship. So we just talk about spouse itself. So that's the reason why today I spent two topic: spouse,、mm -hmm. romance, luck. Besides romance, luck, you got to concentrate on friends and relationship.、Yep. Yes. Now in the way, also, ah,、uh, ah,、uh, one more thing before we end: sibling, palace, and friends. Ah,、uh, if you build this good relationship, you are、mm -hmm. very successful in your achievement.、Mm -hmm. If you build very good relationship with your parents, you are very successful also in your career. So that's the reason why it is a system of life philosophy. It、yeah. teaches you how to be a good person. Yeah. Right. Right. So yeah, thank thank you so much, Master Lin, for、you. sharing all these、uh, palaces. So um, to, before we end the session, I also think that all these palaces, right, is like a 人生的一个修行的道场，道场。这些这些地方都是你该修的。Uh, we don't look about Lu Quan Kezi. All these palaces are equally important. Not only spouse palace. Of course, today the topic is about spouse. But actually, I would think that you govern. Uh, you manage every all the palaces in 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 a yin yang 调和的话，全部东西就会很顺了。所以觉得人生就是一场修行。这个修行，每个人都是我们的老师。Just like what Master Lilian you share about your children. They can be your teacher. Other people we meet, the 小人 can be our teacher also. I mean, they teach us a lesson. Of course, we pick up the good one, ah,、uh, throw away the bad one, negative one. So they can be our teacher. Correct. It's very interesting. Precisely, and then also, you know, you know, we're talking about 修行修行 means correcting your behavior, right? 修行 doesn't mean that you must go to somewhere and hide in a cave. 修行 means correcting our behavior. Our mental palace taught us to 福德。你要修行，你首先要修修你的福跟你的德行，你的福气跟你的德行。Right, 修行 ，this is all like a 道场。This is the place that we supposed to 修行。If somebody say, oh, go somewhere, no, that's the way. This everyone that's appearing online. This moment we step out of house. Tomorrow, there are, there are people who talk to us. Even let's say we go to the hawker center, these people are talking. Ah, they are also teaching us something. So, so you, the awareness is the thing, is the key that we have to be there. Yeah, you know. Yeah, bring back your slogan.、Right. Yeah, any more questions? Yeah,、uh, I don't see.、Uh, yeah, I don't see any questions anymore. But thank you for your support, uh, Lilian Chin. Thank、David、you. Team, um, they put a thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you、uh, very David, much. David, thank you, uh, David Ho. Thank you, Chiu Ling. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jeffrey. Very, uh, very good sessions. Very interesting. They actually share some comments. So thank、uh, you very much. Yeah, thank, thank you. you so much. And ah,、uh, 我们在这边要祝天下有天下有缘人，健康快乐，健康快乐。We wish all the people that we meet, and we will be meeting again, happy、yes. and healthy. Yes. Thank you, everyone. May all be well. May all be blessed. And may all be happy and healthy. Thank, thank you. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye bye.